So I'm sitting here with my good friend, William Garcia, amazing composer, film composer, songwriter, producer, arranger, MD. You do an amazing job at the church, oh, by thank the way. You. I didn't say that before, but I'm saying it right now. <laughs> thank um, you. I called you um, early this year after we had met with some of the executives from Pure Flix, and um, they told us about this movie, Samson, coming up. And I called you, and I just gave you a little snapshot into kind of what I thought about the song that we should write together. And you know, bringing on a collaborator, you always wanna try to convey what your heart is, what the heartbeat of the song is. And um, you just took the little bit that I gave you and ran with it. It was amazing. So tell me a little bit about the process that you went through getting the music done. Sure. Well, first of all, it was a privilege and an honor. It always is working with you. So <laughs> thank you so much for So inviting. glad you said that. <laughs> <laughs> no, thank you for seriously inviting me to uh, work on this. And it was so cool because when we did meet with Franklin, he was telling us that they were shooting while, like, while we were having dinner and, you know, they were shooting, like, in the next coming weeks um so it's so cool that i got to be a part of it um so you gave me a little bit of vision uh on samson and his, and his life and yeah that was enough for me to portray all the words you put to it you know we talked about him his gift being strength and you know i wanted this song to have moments of you know of strength but also have tender moments because you know he you 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 can talk on this more, but of everything he went through in his life. So I wanted the song to be that kind of a journey, um, and so you came and just put these amazing lyrics to it, and uh, yeah, it came together really nice. It was a lot of fun to do. Well, I uh, just I was on vacation when I got the music from you, and I remember telling my husband Marcus, I was like, "You're not going to believe this music that William sent." It just it was so. Perfect. It was exactly what I wanted. You know, it was just mm -hmm. this powerful, epic-sounding song. And um, I, uh, to be honest, I had a little difficulty getting the lyrics for it because I wanted the lyrics to match the strength and the beauty of the music. It was like you can't just get by with, you know, any old lyric with this this music. It was so powerful. And you know, I remember writing the lyrics. For this song a part of them on the way to the recording session yeah. to do the vocals if you remember when I, I got here I was still like typing them out you know I <laughs> recorded them into my phone on the way over because I just did was not satisfied with just you know mediocrity on this lyric and um, you know it's difficult because not everybody knows the full story of Samson most people know him as this great warrior, you know, he killed all these people and he was super strong and had this long hair, but you know, there's much more to his story. And it's like, how do you tell the story of Samson and it be, um, you know, have a good ending because it's just such really a life wasted in a lot of ways, you know, that middle portion of his life. And um, so it was difficult to write the lyric. And, you know, he was a judge. Not many people know that he was a judge for the nation of Israel, which is like their priest at the time. And um, uh, he was held to certain criteria, like not cutting his hair, you know, that would count him as holy because this was before Jesus. They still, you know, lived under the law. And um, so with his life kind of going off, you know, like wheels off, <laughs> off the track, um, I, I wanted to be able to, to tell that part of the story and yet get back to the end where when he's standing in the temple and he's got his hands on the pillar of the temple and there's all of these evil people really defiling the temple and he asks God's power to come on him again, which was brought the name of the song called Down Power. Um, he called on God to touch him one more time. And when he did, God did what he said. And he uh, touched Samson again, and he pushed down the pillars of the temple and killed all the people who were defiling the temple. But it was difficult telling that story and getting back to the redemptive thing. 
And even though Samson died in that moment, which to me is, you know, that, those are the consequences of the choices that we make in our lives often, you know, um, but God's mercy is always mm. real and his faithfulness is always true. And so when we call on the Lord, he's all, he always answers. He always comes back to that moment of saying, you know, I love you, I'm faithful to you. And um, which is really the heartbeat of this song, I think. And um, the music certainly tells the story, those powerful moments, the tender moments, and um, hopefully the lyrics do too. Absolutely. So um, it was a lot of fun working with you. And I know we'll do Thank it again. You. We've written other songs together and there are yeah. more to come. So Absolutely. It's always a privilege. Thank you. Thank you. I feel the same. <laughs>